uh, today we will show you how to make SD card to up update your card stereo. First, you need to prepare two USB discs. One is for MCU firmware. Another one is for operating system. Okay, now I will show you how to make SD card for the operating system. Uh, first, you need to, you need to download the op operate operating system files and MSU files from your uh, from your computer, and and then this is for operating system. This is for MCU firmware. Now you need to unzip the operating system in your computer. Okay, okay. Look, this is uh, the operating system files after unzipped. Now you need to uh, uh, insert the USB disk to your computer. Before before use it, please format for, format the USB disk. Okay, now please open these files. You see, there is three three uh, files. This is uh, operating system files, and uh, you need to open the second files and uh, find out the SD firmware tool. You need to open this uh, SD firmware tool because we need to use this tool to make the SD card for operating system. Okay, open it. Now you can see this is your USB disk. Uh, please choose this uh, the first choice. And then uh, the third step is to uh, choose the uh, SD update files from your, uh, from your unzipped files. You can choose it. Okay, now you need, op you need to choose this. This is the uh, firmware which you just unzipped. Open it and open this file. Please choose this this files SD update. Choose open it. Okay, the fourth step is to choose the demo file from your unzipped files. Okay. Okay, this file is uh, open this file and open open here. Choose the demo files. Okay, now you can start to uh, create the SD card. Please uh, click this. Uh, choose yes. Okay, now it is a. Uh, uh, making making the SD card uh, SD card firmware. You you just uh, need to wait a few minutes on these steps. It will take uh, about uh, three or four minutes.
okay this message is show up it means that you uh, finish to uh, to make the SD card firmware please click here and and the last uh, step is to open open the third files open it you can find this is these two files please copy these two files to the SD card which you in, insert in your computer open it and copy to here okay now uh, the SD card is finished you can remove it from your computer uh, here here is uh, another MCU uh, USB disk with the MCU file please also also insert in your computer Uh, this is the MCU files which you download from your from the update link. Also need to unzip it. Copy the unzipped files directly to the USB disk. Also need need to format the USB disk first. Copy the two files here. Okay, now you can remove your USB disk. Okay, now you you, you get you get two USB disk. Uh, one is for MCU firmware. Another one is for uh, operating system firmware. Now, first you need to update the MCU firmware. Insert it. Insert it to the USB port, the left side USB port. It will detect the firmware directly and update it by itself. Uh, after after uh, update updating after uh, update finished, it will restart by itself. Okay, now the head unit will will restart by the seal. When the head unit enter to this user interface, you can uh, you can remove your USB disk. Okay, now we we need we need update update the operating system. Also, insert it to the USB port. It will detect the update auto automatically. Okay, please click install. This update will take a few minutes, so please wait, wait patiently.
when when it showed this message, uh, doing action succeed, please remove the USB disk. Now you can remove the USB disk. The head unit will will reboot by itself. When it shows this Android logo, please wait wait another three or four minutes. It need need about three or four minutes to enter the user interface. During this time, please don't power off your car stereo. Okay, now the update is finished. It entered to the user interface.